Hey sweeties, how are you all doing? Welcome to Nanya Semi. This is your first time of coming across this channel. So if you can kindly smash the subscribe button, turn on the notifications so you get notified each time I upload. And please give this video a thumb up. I appreciate you all and I want to say a very big thank you to everyone who for always coming back to watch my videos. You, you all are the very best. So guys, Latino started uh, a follow train, which is ongoing right now, but it looks like something is not right because the black community in uh, Latina felt like they are not included and um, they are not really not happy about it and they are speaking up, right? So um, I am going to run this video so you all can see for yourself. Stay glued to your screen, did not go anywhere. You definitely will not like to miss this. So let's get into it. So my name is Christina. I decided to hop on this Latina follow train. I'm happy it's there. I'm dubious about where it's gonna go because it was originally started by black women and I think it's going to be effective there because black women as a group have always um, chosen their own people over white supremacy and Latinas haven't done that. And you know that. Um, so I just wanted to let you know that in my page, if you don't support black Latinas, you don't support Latinas. If you don't support gay Latinas, you don't support Latinas. If you don't support undocumented or immigrant Latinas, you don't support Latinas. If you don't support feminist Latinas, you don't support Latinas. If you don't support black women, people in the LGBTQ plus um, community, uh, people with disabilities, if you don't support any of these people who are oppressed, then you don't support Latinas because our liberation is tied to everybody's liberation. Anyways, let's get into the stitches and see what people got to say about this. All right. So here we go. Black women as a group have always... Um, chosen their own people over white supremacy and Latinas haven't done that. And you know that, you know, we were never taught to support each other. We were taught to be against each other. And you guys know that. And we were also ingrained in our, in our heads from our parents that to be in white spaces, to be able to make it to white spaces means that we made it and to uphold all that supremacy shit. And for those of us that don't agree with that, it never worked out for us. You know, when our black sisters started this, their lives are at stake. Their, their mental state, their mental health is at stake. Their, their safety is at stake. And they got tired and they wanted unity and they want to feel safe. So they created this to protect themselves. I mean, they literally have spent a, a lifetime, but mostly I noticed this year, even black men just coming after them and telling them that they're not lovable enough, that their that their success is 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 makes them unworthy to be in a relationship. You know, all that all that all that negativity, all that trauma. That's what they have at stake. And we should be supporting that. Wonderful that we decided to create this um, as well. But we don't have anything at stake. And that's, and, and that's my concern, that we're just riding on the coattails of our black sisters who need our support more than anything else. I'm that. And you know that. You know, we were never taught to support it. I'm going to be positive and speak on this because I'm, I'm really hoping that this TikTok generation is not going to be like how my generation was, um, the Latinos of my generation was, the Latinos prior, uh, my mother's generation. I hope that the TikTok generation is going to be different. But let's start off with be fucking for real. Like this whole let's be united, let's be one, black women, Latinas, blah, blah, blah. I cannot stand how Latinas, Latinos really act like there are no black people, that they're not racist. Like y'all need to confront your own racism that y'all have and how y'all will sit here, tiptoe and dance and be for white dollars every time. Every generation has done this. You don't have to worry about throwing black American women under the bus and being united. Don't, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. when y'all are so disrespectful to the black people, 
to the black Latinas in your own land from Puerto Rico to DR, Brazil, Panama, races. Like y'all really need to clean house before y'all start looking over and applauding what we doing, what black American women are doing. I, my mom is Puerto Rican. I'm a, I'm a black Latina. I don't claim it because like y'all not going to just sit here and disrespect me in my face. The amount of times that I've been called mono, the amount of times that I've been called negrita in a disrespectful tone and to only have Jennifer Lopez turn it around and try to make it a term of endearment. Girl, be fucking for real. I still cannot like her to this day. And that was y'all. That was y'all that pandered to her. Like, just figure out how to break the generational chains of the conquistadors and the Spaniards. Because I, I for one, am not going to sit here and, like, preach to my kids to be inherited their Latina roots and all this other stuff. Like, yeah, we're going to go to Puerto Rico, but as tourists. That, mm-mm, 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 mm-mm. Yeah, so come um, this February, let's start seeing Latinos lift up the black, the black Latinos, um, Arturo Schomburg, Celia Cruz, um, Roberto Clemente. I mean, I mean, I can keep going. Tego Calderon. Like, y'all have the opportunity to lift up these individuals twice a year for Black History Month and for Latino History Month, and y'all choose not to. Every time. So this might get me in like trouble, but fuck it. I really think it needs to be said. The Latina follow train is missing so much nuance and acknowledgement of the existence of black women in our community and nobody's talking about it. And on top of nobody talking about the existence of black Latinas, I have yet to see one Afro Latina on that tag. And so I just think it bears reminding that Latinos are not a monolith and that there are white latina creators who are actually benefiting from the racism of the algorithm because they're not being suppressed the same way that black women and black creators are now marginalized creators by and large regardless are being suppressed by the algorithm but the latina follow train is missing so much nuance and so much acknowledgement of racism within our community i thought i would push this out into the algorithm and onto the trend and just see what happens Not Please gonna, listen to this. This follow train is pretty badass. But I want to speak to the phenomenon of something that I've seen that's different between our black sisters and us. I follow a lot of black women and I am seeing them called out in comments repeatedly by palm color people right. asking them, why not us? You're thinking small. Why are you right. excluding us? And All yet, week. I haven't seen anybody call us out. That hasn't happened with us. And we literally. And we're riding on this train. From them. And the idea from the black women. They keep trying to tell us. So while we. So it's up to us. The fruits of To stand with them. Because we talent. decided to ride on this train. Yeah. Don't forget to support. Black women do not stand alone with this. Representation really, really matters. And in my life, I have had more black women show up for me than any other color out there. So if you see that... Black women have helped me too in my life and I stood with me during hard times. Creator, so I stand with them. Even if you're just on here. Add they me. do not I'm stand alone. Back, and I will say something to somebody who's coming at you for protecting what is rightfully yours. I see you, sis. So I am going to ask, wait, why are Latinas like not acknowledging the black community in their country? I mean, why... Do black people, uh, like, you know, why do they have to, like, beg for recognition? Um, and what happened to being black? I just do not get it. I, this There is something off about this and uh, that should actually be corrected, you know? And 
this actually is for black women follow train and uh, latinas decided to start their own follow train and then looks like some poor are excluding the black women and um, which is like totally wrong yeah so there is need for correction like they need to correct themselves they need to like you know <laughs> start another uh follow train if they are not recognizing black women in their own community all right and i see no reason why there should be segregation like you know some people are white to them some people are black and like it's they are the same thing latinas then why the segregation i mean this isn't kind of i mean trying to wrap my head around it and doesn't really make any sense make it make sense it doesn't make sense why some people are excluding some and some people are like you know join the train so if it's gonna be latina it's going to be latin every black and every other person nobody should be excluded because it is black women follow train and nobody was excluded it is black women follow train so if you are going to start a follow train make let everybody be among the train yeah so this is where i am gonna wrap this let me know what you all think and please yeah let me know what you all and thank you so much for your support see you all in my next video bye for now